I've got a parent here with me, and I'm going to be asking you, what ways do you get exa Sorry. Say hello to us, <laughs> to the camera. Hi, camera. Hi. So, she's an amazing parent. What way do you get, or what ways do you get your children interested in books? Um, I think for me, I like to, I buy books from a variety of places. I buy from the shops. I go into charity shops to buy books, and I use the local library. It's cheap. It's free. I don't have to pay anything. So, but I like to take my kids to the library. One, I get them into the habit of going to the library. They see what a library looks like, and to get them interested, I get them to choose the books they want me to read with them and for them. So I have two kids, different ages. So I get them to, you choose a couple of books, you choose a couple of books, and what do we do? Every evening, we make it a habit to sit together and we read, just for the sake of it. So when dinner is done, we've done bath time, it's our downtime. We sit down on the sofa, we have a cuddle, and it's mommy and my kids' time. We read, we talk about the story books, and then after that, what do we do? We talk about our day. So how was your day today? Tell me. Did you have a good day? Did you have a bad day? What happened in your day that mommy needs to know about? Then after that, we have a cuddle and it's time for bed. But most of all, there's so many ways we can get them involved in reading. Okay. My kids have a tablet, so we have a lot of e-books that we download okay. for the kids. A lot of kids, this, this, it is their generation, they do get involved with tablets. Yes. So, and there's so many books that I didn't even know about, but I found them on tablets. And if I can get them to sit down for five minutes and we read it together, I'm happy with that. Okay. Again, I've recently found out about the book trusts. There's so many websites online that you can find out that gives access to, to free ebooks. To, Give us one of them. One I of think the book trusts. Okay. Book, book trusts. I think there's book trusts. Uh, there's another one that I came about which I, I can send you the information okay. and you can give it to your readers. Then we'll write the link at the bottom, of, on the the bottom of the screen. So there's so many online resources that you can just find some ebooks, some free books you can download and just read in your own spare time. Again, audio books is another one. Okay, so it's not just paper books like this. There are different books come in different formats. Definitely. The ebook, um, audio magazines. books, magazines, the online, the ebooks on the tablets or, you know, yes. these kiddie things that electronics, I mean, technology is here to stay so we might as well sort of get used to it in a positive way another thing that i do with my kids when we're out and about when we go to the shop i ask them to read so what is this word school shop mm. bread oranges oh what color is an orange we practice our colors we practice our numbers again whatever opportunity we get to read whether it's outside we can see the bus going past or oh, what number is that yeah. bus so we're practicing our numbers but most of all we're having fun Exactly. Uh -huh. So it's interacting with them every day about the everyday words that you see outside. So you don't always sort of necessarily have to open a book and say, oh, it's reading time. You can actually be walking on the streets and be learning new words exactly. and having fun as well. Make it fun. Yes. With my kids, if it's not fun, they're not interested. <laughs> I don't blame them. <laughs> so make it fun. Yeah. Don't even let them know we're working so hard. Yeah. We're out and about. We're playing. Yeah. But we're learning. We're having fun. And we're enjoying our time together. Oh, thank you so much. That was brilliant. Didn't you guys enjoy that? And I hope this was this was very helpful to you. Thank you so much for watching and thank you so much. Thank you. Good night, everyone. Bye. Bye.